Hello, 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 it's Brandy Janae here with another Simply Gilded unboxing. So if you are interested in seeing what's inside this beautiful rose gold packaging, please be sure to stay tuned. Welcome back everyone. My name is Brandy Janae and I would like to thank you so much for tuning into this video today. If you are new here, then welcome. And if you are returning, thank you so much for being a faithful subscriber. I truly appreciate your support. Be sure to continue to help me get to 1K before the end of the year. I'm almost there and I'm super duper excited. Um, so anyway, inside this beautiful rose gold packaging, we have the next Simply Gilded subscription box. So let's see what is inside. All right. So this box is called Hummingbird Story and it is super pretty and it's so big. Um, it's a lot larger than the other boxes. Um, so I'm very curious to see what's inside here. Hummingbird Story. The colors are really pretty too. All right. So I'm gonna move that out the way. Up first, it says we have a foiled journaling card. Oh, this is the first time I've ever seen the date on here. This is the March sale box. <laughs> There's a foiled journaling card, designer washi tapes, deluxe sticker kit and seals, large printed uh, poche. Mm, I don't know, fancy. A5 stitched binding notebook, engraved gel ink pen, priority sticky tabs, a sparkle charm bookmark, and a mystery item. I do love a mystery item. Can't wait to see what that is. So in here we have our washi tapes, of course, first. The bag is cute this time too. All right, so here is one this week, next week, bill due, um, and then this blue color, which I really enjoy. And here's the hummingbird one that matches the box. Super cute. And we have two of these blue ones. And of course you have your big one and then your smaller one, which are very cute. I love the blue and the purples and the greens and the pink. I like that kind of like ombre effect. It's really pretty. And then this one is super cute with the books. So I, um used to be a super book reader and then I stopped reading and now I just started reading again. So I think I'm gonna do a reading spread in one of my bullet journals because I'm like reading again and it's been so much fun. Um, and then you have these hummingbird stories. So this is like the books and the hummingbirds. Hopefully you guys can see those. Maybe if I put it here, there we go, it's a little better. Super cute, I like the clear stickers. And then of course your journaling card also has the books and the hummingbird on there. Very cute. All right. And then these are the priority sticky note tabs. So this one's called Pink Trumpet. The yellow is Nectar, Sweet Leaf, Bluebell, and then Purple Crown. Those are super cute. And here is the bookmark charm, which I believe we've received something similar to this. Oh, totally forgot about the pin. Gorgeous. And again, you got that nice ombre effect to it. Oh, and it says hope. Cute. Um, with the silver detail. That is very pretty. I don't, they don't normally have any writing on there. So I really like that. And these really are really, really good pins. Like I totally collect and hoard them. <laughs> and then here is the bookmark, which is super cute. Oops. So of course it has the gem on the one end and then the Simply Gilded bow on the other. Very pretty. And then you have the stickers. A 
lots of stickers this time around, which is cool. So you have your icons again, your heart icons, which are cute. I love, again, the um, background colors. I think that's really cool. And then you get your heart dates, which is nice and just the pink and it comes with a few extra icons. Then your small stickers, these hummingbirds are so pretty. Um, of course, you get another set of the bows as usual. Very cute, and I love all of the silver detailing. And then your two large sheets. I love the two dates again. Your next chapter is the greatest one yet. I love that. Sticking with the book theme. The font on these are really pretty too. I wonder what font that is. I like that. Um, and then the books up here, super cute. And then on this side, oh good, three months or three weeks of dates, which is very good. I like the book stack sticker, that's cool. And then this one says hope like the pen and I'm very busy <laughs> with the little hummingbird. So those are very cute, 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 cute. Again, I love these colors. Um, I think the colors are very pretty and very spring-like, which is awesome. And then here's the A5 notebook. I like that size. That's a nice size, the A5. Normally, I think you get the B6, um, but I do prefer the A5 size because it's a little, little, little larger and more space to kind of write in. And then here is the large uh, poche, I think is what it said it's called. I don't know, P-O-C-H-E-T-T-E. -T -T -E. I'm assuming that's poche because pochette sounds weird. <laughs> Poche, poche sounds fancy. Um, so that's pretty. In the um, with the hummingbird inside and then the pink outside, and I like the little pin loop. Now I do currently keep my iPad in one of the other ones. So I'm gonna grab my iPad real quick and see if it'll actually fit in this one as well. Okay, so I'm currently using this one to store my iPad, um, which I absolutely love it um as you can see it's kind of getting a little battered and bruised because i you know obviously carry it around a lot um but let's see oh i need to wipe that off too hmm. no judgment no judgment <laughs> it's a touch screen so yes it definitely fits and it actually fits a little better in this one than the other one and I think it's because it doesn't have all these extra little like pockets and things um, so it actually fits better so I might start using this one and I do love that there's a pin loop in there so um, I can get like a stylus for this and and keep it in there as well so that's really cool um, so yeah that is the poche <laughs> we fancy over here at Brandy Janae we fancy um, so yeah, good size. Just to kind of give you a reference, I think this is the, uh, this is probably like a 10 inch iPad, I would think. I think this is about 10. Let me see. It's a, well, it's like a nine and a half inch. Um, so if you have one of the larger iPads, it would definitely fit. Obviously, if you have a mini, it would be way too big, but it would fit. Um, so that's always just a cool little thing that I found out one day on accident. <laughs> um, so there is that. And then last but not least, it looks like this must be the mystery item because it's not listed. And it's another one of those pin, um, one of those fancy little pin holders. So it just kind of sits in there like so like that, as Miss Tabitha Brown says. And they're just super cute. Um, I think it looks, you know, it would look nice on a desk or whatever. Um, but I love the, I, I'm assuming this is that vegan leather because I know they use that a lot with the Simply Gilded. And it just has a really good quality feel to it. So um, I'm pretty sure that would be the mystery item. And it's super cute. And again, I love these colors. I think the colors are just absolutely beautiful 
So that is everything in Hummingbird Story. I love the combination of the hummingbirds with the books. I think that is super cool. Um, and yeah, I am very pleased with this box and the contents that came inside of it. And I hope that you enjoy this unboxing and that you would be willing to give it a thumbs up and then also subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so. Again, we are on the road to 1K. So please be sure to leave me a comment below and let me know what your favorite item in the box is. And also, if you would, share this video with your friends. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, have a good day, friends. Goodbye.